Hi everyone, today we will see a topic named configuration of business partner and customer and vendor. So it's complete that the configuration today I will do in SAP S4 HANA itself. So first of all, let's start with the configuration step and as you know that we do have a T code of SPRO IMG reference. Go to financial accounting, account receivable and payable, customer account, master data, preparation for creating customer master data. See, here few things I will do. First of all, I will define customer account group with the screen layout of customer. Then. I will create the number range of the customer account and assign the number range of the customer group. Business partner configuration. So first of all, what I will do define account define account group with a screen layout customer. No issue, it is logged. SM12, we do have a T code. So let's open define account group with the screen layout customer. Here, what you will do, we'll do a new entry, and the new entry will enter the account group. Account group we have to insert. See what I will do, I will create the two account group. One is for customer and another was for vendor. But see, as I am as I am creating the account group, right now is for customer only. So APCC, I will use the code as APCC, correct? APCC. Customer account group, customer account for APCC, correct and let's save it. We do have our own uh, TR, we can search it, control F, Okay, so the data has been saved. Now, what we have did, we have created a customer account group only uh, just now. After that, what I have told you, I have told you to create the number range and then we have to assign the number range with the customer account group. So, let's go to create the number range for customer interval. So, what I will do, I will insert uh, any interval uh, let's uh, create new and I will do 0 to I will use the code 0 to and the number range what what we should use let's suppose 0 0 uh, 2 0 0 right 0 0 2 9 9 9 that I'm using and the tick here we have to tick that external also click on enter and click on save so that uh, data will be saved now go back and what i have to do i have to assign the number range so what's the position we have apcc we have created the account group and what will be the number is 02 02 i have created and just save it we have saved see right now we have created it for customer account and the same thing we have to do for vendor account that means supplier account the data is saved right now what we have what we will do as i have told you what we have did for the customer account same thing we have to do for the supplier account and in here what i what we are going to do will create the same number range as we have created for the customer 
the same number number range we will create for the supplier also so first of all we will create the vendor account group and what will be the code we ha we have to use apcv right so apcv we will use vendor vendor testing for apcv click on enter click on save it will save now where we should go as i have told you earlier we have to create a number range for the same and go to interval the same 0 to 0 0 the sorry yeah the same number range we have to use 2 9 so that if we will create the uh, business partner and we will uh, create the uh, vendor and the customer that time both uh, all three having the same number so for having the same number we should have the same number range also right go back now what we have to do we have to assign the number range now apcv we have created a number range what we have created the number range 0 to just click and go to save i hope till now whatever i have explained it to you you have understood and let's check it out uh, whether the external tick has been ticked or not yeah it has been ticked now what we'll have to do we'll have to do the same for the business partner also so for the business partner what we'll have to do we'll have to go to cross application component so go back and where we do have the cross comp cross application component here it is we do have the cross comp application component and we do have business partner where's the option c sap business partner and next in that one we do have a business partner after that we do have basic setting after that number range and grouping so what we have to do first of all we'll have to define the number range correct so here i am defining the number range so whatever the number we have created that time we'll have to assign the same number range that means 0 2 0 0 and 2 9 the same thing we have to use here right save yeah save see in the business partner number range we don't have to check uh, click on external because as we have assigned the number range so it will generate the uh, internal number range automatically so now what we have to do we have to go back define grouping and assign number in here what we will create we will create a group so for that what we have to do we will have to go for new entries simple go to new entries let's suppose what we will give the code of uh, customer uh, sorry business partner uh, apgg let's suppose we are giving the code apgg uh, business partner business partner so apgg will give the code and what will be the short text anything testing and description also will give the testing there is no issue and the number range 0 to what we have created over here right <coughs> click on save yeah after that what we have to do we'll have to go we'll have to go in the master data synchronization in the cross cross application component only so here we do have the master data synchronization 
and customer slash vendor integration and we do have a business partner setting go there go there and here we will do the setting for customer integration see whatever we will do the customer integration the same thing will have to do for the business uh, that vendor integration also see we do have another option uh, like setting for vendor integration field assignment for customer integration assign key and now we do have check it out here define number assignment for direction bp2 customer that means we are defining and assign assigning in the form of uh, that first of all we will create the business partner then from the business partner we will convert it into the customer execute the same now click on new entries whatever the group we have created for customer APCC sorry the common group what we have created the common the business partner APGG right APGG correct testing and account APCC for customer and see what we want we want the same number for uh, the business partner as well as the customer so tick on here that uh, so that if we will create the same business partner as a customer then the same number will generate we will check it out at the time of creation of business partner and at the time of taking check, uh, creating of business uh, customer right so till now it is okay again what we have to do we will have to do the same for business partner uh, sorry supplier also so customer integration will have to close open the vendor integration then field assignment assign key and we have again we have to do the same define number assignment for direction bp2 vendor right execute here also we will have to do the new entry what is the group we have created ap G, sorry ap gg we have created the group correct and what's a uh, vendor group we have created the vendor group we have created apcv correct apcv and what we have what we need the same number that means the business partner as well as the vendor also will having the same number click on enter and click on save so see till now what we have did the configuration has been completed now we will check it out whether the configuration what we have did is correct or not so how we'll check in the sap s4 hana we do have a t code uh, to create uh, business partner is bp and from there only we can create as uh, the customer as well as a vendor also so what's the grouping we have created apgg i think we have created right so let's check out uh, apgg for testing yeah and what i want to create right now the business partner general after that i will extend see the business partner testing business testing business partner and test straight name m a h t m a mahatma gandhi gandhi mar and what will be the b 765 that i am taking postal code 201301 noida country code in we are taking country slash region region i am taking 24 and uh, yeah as number of data you wanted to fill you can fill en telephone number mobile number anything we can check and the sales at test dot com click on enter
सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वाट वी आर डूइंग वी आर डूइंग वी आर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल क्रिएटिंग अ बिजनेस पार्टनर एंड क्लिक ऑन सेव Our business partner has to start with the number is two. That means till now our configuration is correct. Now what we have to do, we'll have to create what? Let's create first of all the customer, and we'll check whether it is working. Uh, let's create the vendor. That vendor, I have to get the option. So vendor, select the vendor, and we do have the company code data. Let's check out. Let's fill the company code data. Company code I do have AUDI. I have created Recon account. Let's check it. Let's check the same. As number of data you wanted to fill, you can fill. Right now I am saving the same. Correct. So see the supplier. That means the vendor has been created with the same number. As the number range, as the same business partner having the same number, and with the supplier also we have created the, with the same number. Now, as we have created for company code data, let's create for purchase purchasing data also. So in the purchasing data, go to purchase organization. Here we do have the AD, sorry, ADPO. We do have the purchase organization. I have created. Click on enter. We do have the order currency is INR. as we are indian and uh, payment term will be anything 003 we can uh, select it from here also yeah 002 anything as per the condition let's save see till now it has been completed now what we will do we will create the customer select the customer here click on enter we do have the sales data so fill the sales data adso we do have the sales organization distribution channel is a1 see right and the sales district price group mm. right and control save see it has been saved and let's check it out where we'll check we'll check the same thing in the company code data in the company code data we can check see so as we can see the customer also having the same number and the supplier also having the same number and the business partner also having the same number that means the configuration what we have did Uh, to create this is absolutely correct and the same number means what the number range we have assigned see there having certain condition if if you wanted to if you wanted to create a business partner with the same number of the customer as well as the supplier so that means the group whatever you have created you must uh, assign with the same number range uh, with the customer and the supplier also in the supplier also having the same number range and the uh, customer also have the same number range then only it will create if suppose if you have the business partner having the different number range and the customer also having the different number range and the supplier also having the different number range but still you are uh, clicking on the check box that you wanted the same in that will in that case it will not generate it will give you error like right it's uh, enough for today so thank you thanks for watching my video and if you like the video please do like on please hit on like button and please do subscribe my channel so that you will get update while i upload the new video okay thank you